You, you met people like uh, the late uh, Ufe Bwanyi of Ivory Coast, correct? Yes, I met him, yeah. What about, uh, uh, what about uh, uh, was it Bernard Bongo? Or oh, Omar yeah, yeah. Bongo? Yes. Of Gabon? Uh, I'm, yeah, I met him also, yeah. yeah. In fact, we made at the reception first because I was representing this company as a model and a cover girl. And so that's where I met with his wife, the kids. Mobutu uh, Seseko. Yeah, Mobutu. That was, was this that, because that was of being time, in really. France? Is it because you were in France and these no, people no. speak French or what? No, no. I, I was not living. No, when I met with Bongo, I was in Paris. But uh, Marshal Mobutu Seseko, I met him in 1990. I'm already in, uh, in Dallas. So I moved here 1981 officially, but of course working all over. So it was not about that. So you, fact, are an, you are an advocate of social economic justice for all of us. Yes. Are you concerned about uh, the fact that uh, those leaders uh, were very heavily criticized for their human rights records? Yes, that's why I made with them. To make them understand the importance of freedom, you know, the importance of peace and reconciliation the importance of sitting around the table mm. and discuss instead of trying to solve a problem, you know, by means of, uh, like you always said, 45. <laughs> <laughs> uh? the, the, you said uh, AK-45. AK you always say, yeah, AK 47. 47. yeah. You, you also, I, never, you, I never use that, so you, you also, I'm just borrowing you, it from you. You also met another leader who takes advantage of AK-47, Ugandan <laughs> president, <laughs> Yoweri Museveni in Dallas. Uh, yes. <laughs> What did you yeah. talk about? Yeah. No, he came to it. He came to introduce uh, 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 business yes. and investment for Uganda. And he was looking for businessmen. Yeah. In fact, not women. In fact, I have never seen um, that much Anglo-American or European-American corporate, uh, 800 people, um, and, uh, you know, at the conference. And we were, you know, and so I was one of... What did you say to him, 30 seconds, because we have to go for a new bit? Okay. Um, well, when he, inter you know, I'm like, you know, like I say, straight talk. Yes. <laughs> and you said? So when he opened his statement, you know, why he came to, um, to Dallas, he said he came to meet with the uh, American businessman. Mm -hmm. And so I asked him, Mr. President, do you think American female are not making a difference mm -hmm. in terms of the American business? How did he Imme respond? Oh my gosh, that was great. He immediately apologized. Good. He said, let me rephrase it, let me say it, let me say it. You know, he was not nervous or he was not kind of like, how do you ask me? Uh, you know, immediately corrected. He started from the beginning and that was nice of him. Very good.